What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing with you kind of like an acne skincare starter kit in my opinion. Um, I have a friend who was asking me, hey, I want to start like doing more with my skincare. What do you recommend? And initially I was like, Mario Badescu, Mario Badescu. Mario Badescu because Mario Badescu is amazing that is the skincare brand that I was recommended when I first like started trying to take care of my skin and my acne so and ever since then every product that I've tried from them has been amazing so that was my number one suggestion to her but then I was like you know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go and buy her my essentials like the things that I think anyone should start off with if they really want to start taking care of their skin if they really want to combat acne that type of stuff so i'm going to share with you guys what i bought for her for her um like as kind of a video for you guys so that you can know like what are my i guess you could say highest recommended products for people who are just starting to deal with skincare and like be more involved in their skincare because there's plenty of other products that I absolutely love and would consider like my holy grail products but I don't necessarily feel like they're the best products to just start with so these are the skincare products that if you really want to start caring about your skin and doing more with your skincare routine then I highly suggest sorry then I highly suggest checking these products out the first stop is going to be some version of micellar water that is my number one recommended thing for anyone who wants to take their skincare to the next level micellar water right here I have the Garnier for skin active cleansing water um, the reason I went with this one is because a it's a very basic micellar water it's nothing too fancy it's not fragrant I mean most of them aren't fragrance there are a few cleansing waters that are but this one's very basic it's easy to repurchase at the drugstore and I, you get a lot of bang for your buck this is 13.5 fluid ounces for $8.99 like it's pretty much a great deal and it's easily accessible like I bought this at Ulta but you could get it at Target you could probably get it at like your grocery store it, because Garnier is like one of those products that like everyone carries so I highly highly recommend getting a cleansing slash micellar water to use this is when you would use after you wash your face you put it on a cotton pad go all over your face kind of like your toner in a way you can still use a toner um, but I don't recommend like jumping into like some full-blown skincare routine um, you gotta ease your way in and like figure out what products work best for you so just adding a few little products in at a time will help you know if your skin freaks out to something you can be like I added this that's why but um yeah I, this is something that is like a double cleansing so you wash your face and then you use this and you can even see like leftover dirt and makeup that was on your skin and you're just like what? I already washed my face and this is what happens I used a makeup wipe and wash my face and this is still what happens this stuff is amazing I love my cellar water you could also do the simple one that one is pretty good like for a drugstore my cellar water oh I just found that the size of the simple one was smaller for the price versus the Garnier Fructis one so that's why I went with the big guns um but yeah so you could even like use that instead of a face wash if you're really looking for like simple like I'm a college student I just need to get up and out in the morning so like you could totally just use that as like your face wash toner moisturizer if you really wanted to I personally love having like a long involved skincare routine so but like on my quick days or nights like I will totally use this I love this stuff Next up is a facial spray. Uh, I Ever since I started using a facial spray on the daily, I feel like my skin is just so much more hydrated and happy. And even though I have like combination oily skin, like I find that keeping my skin hydrated helps it not overproduce oils, which I mean is science. But um, one of my tried and true absolute favorite facial sprays that is a affordable and b easily accessible is the mario badescu facial spray with aloe herbs and rose water this stuff will change your life if you are at all wanting to up your game like this is the number one recommendation 
that I have probably like these two are like huge 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 additions so if you do like two things for your life this year add micellar water and add a facial spray start off trying out this Mario Badescu one because it's life-changing it's amazing it makes your skin feel so great it just like adds this extra layer of moisture to your face and it's just so great um especially now that we're like kind of going into the colder colder months um your skin needs help your skin just needs a little boost and facial sprays are something that will give it that little boost so i highly 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 recommend it next up is sheet masks this one is by tony moly which i actually just bought not too long ago my first few from tony moly these are four dollars and like any other sheet mask I've ever tried has been like at least seven or eight dollars, but four dollars for such a high quality sheet mask. I mean, it's nothing like you have gold or snail goo on your face. Like it's like a really soft, 100%, I believe it's 100% cotton sheet mask. Um, yeah, cotton 100, boom. But um, I have tried the honey one, I've tried this one. I really, really love them four bucks can't do you wrong and this is a skin soothing one so for people who are kind of like breaking out and just kind of starting into skincare you don't want to do anything too crazy like you know revamp your face and peel everything off you know you kind of want to ease into it so a soothing one is super super good and these are four bucks at Ulta like you can't beat that for the quality my skin like I tend to use them at night and then I'll let them sit on my face for like 20 minutes to half an hour it's like my chill time I'll read a book a magazine I'll do like some um like play a game on my iPad or just like listen to music and just sit there I love it so much and like I like I said I use them at night the next morning my skin feels so hydrated and glowy it's amazing and four bucks I know you're probably thinking like four bucks for one use but like considering the fact that a lot of the other ones that cost like eight to twelve to twenty bucks and you're still getting like the same type of effect for four bucks that's pretty impressive to me so that's why I think everyone should add that to their skincare routine Next up is another classic by Mari Badescu. It is their drying lotion. Now, I just tried this for the first time. Believe it or not, how obsessive I am about Mari Badescu. I just tried this for the first time like two months ago, maybe three months ago, and I'm obsessed. Anytime I have a breakout, I just put this on at night. All you do is you don't shake it up. There's like separation. Here, you can kind of see it here. There's like separation, so there's oil and then there's this mud and clay down here. You dip your Q-tip all the way down and get it in the pink stuff, pull it out. Like I said, you don't shake it, so you keep it separated. And you just dot it on your breakouts overnight. Even if you have like 15 minutes in the morning before you have to like wash your face or like put on your makeup or something, it helps so much. It just like soaks it up without drying things like super crazy because my thing is with a lot of spot treatments you have issues with it just like completely drying it up and then it looks like even worse than just having a zit on your face but this stuff is really great it just kind of like disappears it and then it's easier to cover up the next morning so I highly recommend it to anyone who's dealing with breakouts um, if you are like more like breaking out in patches so it's like a bunch of little breakouts or a bunch of little breakouts i recommend their anti-acne serum i actually have it let me show you this is their anti-acne serum it's like a little gel that you will just put let's see i've used up just like that much but like when you're having a like a bigger breakout more than just like a few around your face like one little section of your face is breaking out then you just rub this all over it and it's really really great like I love that stuff um but yeah next up these are two things that I didn't necessarily buy they kind of came as like extra gifts in like um purchases that I made online at Sephora um but they are products that I absolutely love so I'm going to give them to her um the belief the true cream aqua balm this is a moisturizer and it's just it's super super amazing it's like creamy and thick with moisture but not like thick to where it feels like you're putting on some really heavy cream like 
it's good enough to just like use as your morning moisturizer you can use it at your night like i love this stuff it's super super good it's like from a korean brand i believe but it's just like it's so good for your skin and it, it's um i know they do a lot of stuff to make sure that there's nothing like gross and chemically in it i mean there are some chemicals but like the main ones that people are freaking out about they don't have in there and then lastly for exfoliation i was gonna buy her the mario badescu botanical exfoliating scrub so i was gonna get that but i ended up not and then this came in one of my little sample things it is the dr brandt microdermabrasion um what is it it's just microdermabrasion age defying exfoliator uh this stuff is really really good i love it i also like the the pore one i forget what it's called but it's blue it's like this but it's blue so i really like um this as an exfoliator it's not like crazy crazy um rough but it still gets the job done and leaves your skin feeling super super smooth can you hear that my neighbor's car is literally the most obnoxious car in the world it's so loud and then he like starts it up and lets it run for like 20 minutes in the morning so annoying okay so those are the products that i would recommend for anyone who's starting out in wanting to like expand their skincare routine or amp it up and make it like a thousand times better um so let me know what your recommendations would be for someone who's like just starting out or just now getting obsessed with skincare um because i want to check them out and if maybe i've tried them before then i could be like hell yeah that's a really great one and then i can if I haven't heard of it, I can just buy it and then I will be on that same bandwagon with you. But yeah, so <laughs> thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!